Now, considering some of the margin of victory in these uh, national, state, and local races, for example, Senator Johnson winning re-election by about 1%, incumbent Democrat Steve Doyle retaining his assembly seat with 51% of the vote, and as mentioned earlier, John Siegel winning that race for La Crosse County Sheriff by just 175 votes. News 19's Dave Soley spoke again with the UW La Crosse political analyst Tim Dale about governing after these races, Dave, that are so close. Well, Dustin Dale says one of the more interesting occurrences during elections is that voters become increasingly angry about divisive politics. So after an election, there's a reckoning in this way. Candidates who may have been divisive are now supposed to represent everyone, not only people who voted for them. And so one of the things that is uh, important for voters to watch is how uh, representatives respond to that. How do they respond to a world in which someone wins an election and maybe wins a close election? How will that governing take place? The answer is that different candidates handle that differently. Some want to continue the anger and divisiveness, but Dustin, after a couple of years of that, it's real important that you watch to see how representatives respond. All right, thanks, Dave. And at some point, according to Dale, voters could become tired of the fighting and vote accordingly.